So this Jinxie and his girlfriend breaking up situation is uh, crazy, to say the least. Uh, I got the video here pulled up. We're going to go through, listen to what Jinxie has to say, and uh, give a little bit of a take on it. So we'll go ahead and get the full screen, though. Full screen. So I think cheating and disloyalty would be um, like watching, you know, videos that you shouldn't watch, like while you're in a relationship. And I think you guys know the type of videos Sorry I'm about, about. I'm on like Twitch, so I'm trying to not like say. That's what we're going to Like I watch YouTube, um, yeah, you know, you like be careful. those videos, like, uh, fuck it, uh, corn, <laughs> while I was in a relationship uh, multiple times. I also told her that, like, literally, while that was happening, I said. Okay, he, he's talking about his girlfriend here. Well, previous girlfriend, uh, Bricky Hill. Bricky Hill is that, like, I think if you watch those videos, that's cheating. And, um,. I was like doing that and that like okay so he's saying you know watching those kind of videos online that to him is cheating okay so it doesn't uh, you can have your own take on that I have my own take on that him though to him he believes that is cheating so having a girlfriend watching those kind of videos that's his take on it me uh, that's a weird one right um I could see it. I could see it, right? Because you're mentally invested in another person. I, I can get it. And, and what too much so, of it's just unhealthy. Like that was like for months of the relationship. And then when she eventually found out, it was like there was just a hole in the relationship. <laughs> and um, I like, like things were never like really perfect. Well, so Breaky busted him. Uh, she she found out later into the relationship that he was watching these videos. And from what I'm gathering from it, uh, he had talked with her about that, that he thought it was cheating. And then she catches him doing that. So it's... <laughs> uh, after that. And um, I know that there's been a lot of like breakups and stuff and like people... Um, think that we like farm it or whatever, but like we really don't. Like we genuinely don't. Oh. On the whole farming thing too, I did see uh, a couple other content creators on Twitter. I don't know how true it is. Um, believe nothing you hear and half of what you see. But uh, uh, there was other content creators saying that uh, they were still together and were just uh, farming content, like uh, just getting attention. I cannot confirm that. I have no idea. I don't know how those people even come up with that. Who knows? To be honest, like neither of us really um, want everything to be public, but um, it's just like you know, it's I hard for things not to be public the, when you're uh, when you're big know, content like, creators the, like the that. The thing that hurt her feelings a lot, which makes sense, is like everybody always says that she was like cheating on me and she was like taking advantage of me or using me or cheating on me and um she doesn't like i can tell you like she doesn't care about that shit i know her really well i've known her for a long time she doesn't care about that shit uh yo low-key too there's also someone that said that like shortly after their breakup she was at another content creator dude's house uh cuddled up with him and uh, like jason the ween maybe i don't know how true that is either but if that's true um, and like, it sucks to see that, like people would say like, oh, that I was the one that, um, was getting cheated on. But in reality, like I was the one watching like, um, you know, corn videos. So all I can say for like what I, the main thing I want to say there is like, I had been, you know, I had been watching corn since I was like 13 years old and that's like a sick, disgusting addiction. And I mean, dude, I was like. I've been addicted to that for a long time and I don't watch um, those videos anymore. And I'm like proud of that. That's crazy and extremely unhealthy, man. It gives you unreasonable expectations of uh, relationships as well. Because I think it's disgusting anyways. And I don't think it's like healthy. Um, Fair. There was Fair. also like other things that I put her through. So, um, so yeah, I watched, uh, corn videos, but like, not only that, like I would watch like specific videos, uh, to where like, 
Um, there was like screenshots of videos that I watched, and like she eventually like would like found out about that. Like she didn't want to, but she did. And then I like it broke my heart to see that I heard her. And um, so he was also keeping like screenshots from these videos. I wonder if it's like screenshots from like videos or if it was stuff he was finding on Twitter. Either way. Yeah. Strange. That's like something where like I'll probably, I'll like probably never. Mm, It's falling apart here. I'll probably, um, I'll probably never forgive myself for that. I, I think I'm a, I do think I'm a good person, but I think, um, watching, I think watching any type of like adult films while you're in a relationship is cheating. I know like there's probably a, there's probably some like idiots. Ah, man, you, you can tell he's bothered by it. Uh, it's kind of, it's tough. Um, this is something he can bounce back from, though, man. He's young. He's very successful. Uh, and part of realizing uh, something is wrong and being able to correct it is just being able to admit that something's wrong and knowing what that something is. So uh, he's off to a good start. Uh, man, I hope he figures it out, pulls himself together, um, makes some changes. He'll be fine. He, he, he'll be fine. It's that don't think that, but like, if you actually do care about a human being, like if you really do care about a person, you wouldn't do that. And, um, that's something where I'll probably never forgive myself for that. Um, and, uh, other things like another thing that like she found out about like recently, but this happened a while ago, but it doesn't even matter when it happened. But like, well, I was like talking to her, like we weren't dating yet, but like while we were in like the talking okay, so stage, they were just like, talking stage. I was like talking Not to another girl and then, um, I like stopped talking to her, but then she asked me like for my number. And then I said, um, yeah, I'll send you my number. But then I never sent her my number, but that like hurt her feelings to know that I was even like talking to anybody else. Uh, that, that, that's strange. Uh, dude, you're not even dating. You're just talking. There's zero seriousness there. Uh, nothing to get upset there. I don't think. There's like zero reason to get upset there. You're you're just you're just talking, like there's no dating. You're not official, nothing like that. Um, I don't think there's any reason there to be upset. Um, like while we were in the talking stage, and I think ultimately, like, um, there's like a lot of things where, um, like when you're telling somebody Yo, that you think watching, is that a hickey on his neck? Y'all see that, right? <laughs> that's a big ass hickey on his neck like adult films or is cheating and then you're doing it it's like very fucked up and I think about that all the time that I wish I could just go back in time and like fix that uh, but I can't and I feel really bad for her because everybody kind of just <clears throat> uh, would like drag her name through the mud but at the end of the day like I was the only one who ever like really fucked up like ever. I'll touch um, more on and yeah, there's Bricky not here just in like a moment as well. That, but like, you know, I would, there was a, like, there, there's a lot more a to the story. <laughs> where I was like stalking other people on social media, like other girls. And, um, she found out about that and that broke her heart, which broke my heart because. Okay. So the way I tell you, he said stalking other girls, uh, I'm assuming online, this dude was like, going to very specific people, seeing what they were doing all the time and watching their videos or whatever. Uh, Man, it it sounds like he was just uh, living an unhealthy life. Uh, Definitely not good for a relationship, a a good stable relationship. And it's not good for his overall mental health either. Uh, Like I said, it gives you unrealistic expectations. And, uh, Obviously, it's addicting. He can bounce back, though. He can bounce back. I don't want to like. I don't want to hurt somebody that cares about me. And I think if I like, we're just being completely honest with you guys. I think watching like um, corn and stuff like that is a very unhealthy addiction. And it's. 
I didn't even realize because I was true, never true, been in true. a relationship before. But I had no idea the damage that that could do to someone. So the advice part of life, life, man, you I live and you learn is to never live and learn. Put so, if you care about like if you're in a relationship and you care about the girl that you're in a relationship with, um, just don't watch videos like that because it hurts them more than you could like know. I know obviously like guys and girls brains are wired differently. That's like, you know, just science, but like, um, it's really not something that is okay or acceptable. And it, I think it is cheating. It's not like you're obviously nothing is as bad as like, if you go and have sex with somebody or I see where somebody. he's coming from here. Nothing like I said, it's bad it, as that. more like, mental watching um, just a mental those thing. videos is not good for a relationship. True. Um, under like any circumstance. And, um, yeah, I just like, and, um, currently like people want to know, um, if we're like together or not, we're not, uh, okay. So too much of a good thing. Definitely hundred percent. Uh, he just went over way overboard with it, man. And, and like I said, you can have your own opinion on it, but to him, that was cheating, right? I noticed some, some people that that's not cheating. You're not going to view that as cheating. That's fine. But to him and her in that relationship, that was, and he was doing that. And of course she's going to be upset. The only part, big part that I got a problem with is this Brecky girl is an only fans creator, right? So, uh, from my understanding, at a bare minimum, um, she's posting nudes on there, even while in a relationship with him. Now, yeah, she's making good money from that. Uh, he, 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 he's maybe okay with it, but to me, that's weird. Like, how can you get upset about anything when you're posting your nude photos out there for other dudes to look at? Like, you're wanting that. You're wanting them to view You're wanting them to pay that subscription or whatever to be able to view your content. You want them to lust over you. So I find it weird that she's upset about that. And he was doing what she was wanting other dudes to do. <laughs> you can't make this up. It's so strange to me. And, and that's not to get uh, now. I, I haven't seen it myself, but, I seen something in, I don't know if it was this video or another video in the comment section where she, you know, they had, she had more, uh, um, how can I word this corn content on her only fans. So you, you catch my drift, right? So that's out there. I don't see how you can be upset about your boyfriend watching corn. And there's literally videos out there of you that you willingly put out there for other dudes to watch. Uh, but once again, <clears throat> this is focused on Jinxie. He felt like he was cheating. Uh, I mean, if that's his mindset, that's good. Uh, I'm glad he recognized that, you know, that much of corn was unhealthy. I hope he, I hope he's able to, you know, Pick himself up, man. It's easy to recover from. Of course, it'll take some time uh, to unwire the brain and get it focused. But, uh, yeah. Yeah, man. I, he, he'll be fine. Uh, the dude got, <clears throat> what's the word? Gooning, right? He got called gooning. And, uh, but yeah, I still, <laughs> the dude, it blows my mind that an OnlyFans creator who is an active, who is in an active relationship and posting uh, nude photos and had previously before they, you know, got into a relationship or posting, uh, corn videos is upset that her boyfriend was watching that. Come on, dude. I feel like he, he got taken advantage of a little bit on this one, a little bit, <laughs> just, just a little but, uh, yeah, yeah, man, it's weird to me, uh, Jinxie, you'll be fine, brother, keep your head up, you'll bounce back, but, yeah, dude, uh, let me know what you guys think down in the comments below, uh, thank you all for watching, I'm out.